What's up guys, welcome back to the shop. Last week's video did not turn out as expected since I had to reforge it because I forged it backwards. But in today's video, we're gonna be using the other billet, the one that's more of a sand mine construction. And we're gonna be forging the blade from the other video because now I just, I wanna hold that blade in my hand and I think it's gonna look great in sand mine as it would have in the other pattern. But let's get to it.
All right, guys, so this is the profile I'm looking for on the knife. I'm going to grind it into shape, cut off that little end piece, and start cleaning it up. All right guys, so we're ready for heat treat. The knife is coming out pretty good. I like the handle, I like the shape. Time to heat up the forge and harden this bad boy up. All right guys, so we're out of the temper. The knife is looking pretty good. Uh, we're gonna put this aside for now and we're gonna be working with we're gonna be working with burlap some red burlap I've already cut up into squares and we're gonna be making some micarta with it burlap micarta I guess it's micarta I'm gonna infuse it with resin and we're gonna make our handle material so we're gonna do that for now All right guys, so it's in the press, it's hardening up. It takes about an hour to cure. The stuff cures really, really fast. So in the meantime, I'm gonna get to grinding my knife right here. These cosplay belts get some really nice finishes when you don't feel like hand sanding, like I don't feel like hand sanding. It gives a very nice and even look to it. I'm gonna clean it up and get it ready for our etch now. Alrighty, so we're out of the acid and you see the edge is right on the right spot right where it should be the core steel You can clearly see where it's at versus where the rest is at, but I want that core steel to be a little bit darker So now that I've cleaned it up got all the oxide off. We're gonna go straight into some coffee Our Coffee right here Straight into some coffee We'll be staying right there overnight
All right, guys, so the knife is essentially almost done. The handle is shaped out. Feels nice and comfortable in the hand. It's a little bit wider than I, what I would have liked, but I dropped the ball and did not thin it down enough. And I just went with it, and still it's pretty comfortable in my hand, so I like it. Other than that, the build is going pretty well. One thing I particularly did not like is that I crossed over with the belt right there and on the other side as well. So because of that, I'm going to be throwing it back into the acid. No coffee at this time. I'm just going to go straight into the acid. Didn't make enough of a difference for me to want to leave it in coffee again. And overall, it's coming out pretty nicely. So I'm going to etch it again, clean it up, and sharpen it. Alright guys, so the knife is done. It looks very, very nice. I'm very happy with it. Like I said prior, the handle is a little bit on the wider side, but it fits my hand pretty well. I can use this for chopping stuff and whatnot. It's a pretty comfortable knife. Uh, on the note of the build, it is a sand my construction and it is a lot more sturdy than the previous one I did with the screws as well. The thing I don't like about the other one is that it's very, very, very easy to bend. I cannot bend this guy. Well, I mean, this guy is a little bit thicker. The other one was supposed to be this thick, but, you know, shit happens. But the other one, I can bend it completely. If I wanted to, I could just grab it and, and bend it in half. And uh, I just don't think that's a reliable type of knife. This, on the other hand, I, I can cut, I can whack, I can do all kinds of stuff. And I... I'm very confident that it will not bend or break because that core steel is holding everything together. But guys, as always, thank you very much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. The channel is growing. It's growing rather quickly. Jump on and follow us on our journey. And to everybody who has subscribed recently, thank you very much. I greatly appreciate you. And to everybody that's already subscribed, thank you very much. I greatly appreciate you. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.